summer presentation and when I attended it I was really impressed by the interest that the students had, their desire, their enthusiasm and their hunger for more opportunities. I think mentorship, particularly for the minority community, is hugely important. I think it's important because these students don't really have the opportunity to see what it's like to get their hands wet and actually see what it's like to be in the different health professions. The biggest response I get from students is when they see me is, wow, you're a, you're a veterinarian. Never seen a veterinarian look like you. And I take that as a compliment. Not that the color of my skin should be an issue, but hey, it's an issue. We don't see a lot of providers of color, and so therefore children of color just don't see themselves reflected. They don't know where they fit. So to see someone like me lets them know that they can to work in these fields. It also makes them feel like there's someone that they can relate to when they have questions. For me, it gave me the opportunity to speak to a wide range of motivation and interest. Health in general requires diversity. And having individuals who are focused and diverse that will be able to provide for that in the future is going to be valuable. This this program is important to share information with adolescents that don't know what they don't know. They don't even understand how many different options there are within the healthcare realm. When you think of uh, the field of health, people tend to think it's just a doctor or just a nurse. So we definitely try to expose them to allied health, everything that encompasses being in the health field. Mentorship, as you think about the concept, it's not uh, in a classroom setting. I mean, it takes many different shapes and forms. These programs help students that look like me and students that may not look like me, but they're achieving things that some others may have thought that well, they're not smart enough to achieve. A lot of times in the medical profession, people feel you have to be smart, but it's more about sticking to it. I've been a part of a lot of programs, and this is the only one that has really brought medical professionals together with high school students directly. When I was younger at, at this age, I was in high school and junior high, and I spent time going to different hospitals and, and trying to figure out what I wanted to do in the health field. And I think that one way for uh, our youth and some of our underprivileged youth to know what they want to do and choose a profession is to be involved with it early on and kind of help them go on a path of health professions or going to college or just simply just be a mentor so they will have someone to look to and look up to. I've noticed a big difference in Emily where she is more engaged. My child is only in the fourth grade but it's absolutely phenomenal that even at the third grade she showed an interest and aptitude in helping someone other than herself. This program is actually perfect for her to get the one-on-one -on -one internship with the various doctors that are part of the program currently. It will like increase my knowledge of like what I want to be, like give me more choices. It's super important for the parents to be involved with their children and getting them to various programs and workshops that Sharon offers. As parents, we can provide transportation, also just being a physical support, not just the uh, health profession doctors, but as well as someone that they interact with on a day-to-day uh, -day basis. Well, we're now working for one force, and that's one goal, that our children go to college, whether it's medical school, law school, or anything out there. Our children need to become the best that they're able to become, and that's through the encouragement of a parent uh, board, as well as just parenting in general. I want to return to the program because it was um, lots of fun learning about how the doctors do their stuff. Okay. A summer program is good but absolutely not enough. I think that maybe the length of time or the, the job shadowing uh, periods of time don't just happen once a year, but period periodically throughout the year. I think that would also be very important. Um, I have loved being a part of the program. It allows us to use our skills and use our commitments and give back. I was really happy to be in this role, to be able to share with these students some of the things that I've received from mentors, such as Ms. Sharon. What we're doing, it's, it's making a difference. Maybe sometimes you're not able to accurately capture the metrics, but uh, when the students, I read all of their evaluations, and one of the, the largest complaint was, this program was too short. And I'm going, it was a week, it was a lot of work. But that lets me know that the need is there and they were hungry for it. And as much as we want to give, there are students there to receive it. So it was a wonderful experience and I'll continue to do what I can and help and support Ms. Sharon and other community members.